I'm George Acorn with Fortitude. I'm here today with Audi's head of design, Stefan Siloff. We have a couple questions from Audi of America's Facebook page. A few questions uh, here for you today, Stefan, about the A3. Yeah. From Joseph Sueda, he's uh, looking at the drawings that were released before, looking at the C-pillar. He's, he's wondering how the visibility might be is, is, is quite an aggressive design, and also how much might this concept change when it goes into production? Well, George, as you know, and hello, Joseph. Um, <laughs> The really good question. I mean, of course, we are always a little bit exaggerating on the show car. So we, for example, chopped over here the roof for 20 millimeter and also made the track about 90 millimeter each side wider. But altogether, you can be promised when a German company is doing, and especially Audi is doing a production car, everything will be on the on the on the point and uh, will be legal. And so. Um, as you know, we have been doing show cars before and we promised a lot, but we fulfilled also a lot. So I would say 85 to 90 percent of what you see over here, you will find in production. Peter Chien writes, asking how this car compares to the A4. Obviously, I mean, uh, every, everything is getting bigger. So we try to keep the car, the A3 concept, rather, rather compact and also the production car will do a nice step from the A3 sedan to the A4 sedan to the A6 sedan. Roughly speaking in measurements, we are still 350 millimeter away, 35 centimeter, from the overall length of the A4. And also from the width and the height, we are in good proportion to the A4. Nevertheless, I'm sure we also have to look after the A4 to really fit him now next generation in between the A3 and the A6. When you look at this car, it's striking how much it reminds one of the, the B5 A4. Is this very close to the B5 in size? It definitely is, George, because as you know, the B5 was one of our most successful Audis in the 1990s, and it, it was also quite compact, really nice sedan, nice Savant as well. And we compared these cars, of course, when we do our presentation, our design presentation, also with the member of the board, we also took the B5 just for fun and put it close to the A3 and the A4. And the A3 gets really close to the old, in quotation mark, old B5. Mark Treiman asks uh, more about the grill, the concept grill. He's seen it now on the, several of the concepts, including the Quattro concept. Wonder if we might see that in production at some point? Well, you know, we, we always follow the, uh, the, the philosophy at Audi. First read is the brand, second read is the individual product. So our icon for the brand Audi really is the single frame. And of course, we have to develop this, let's say, face, the single frame with the eyes, the, the, light, the headlights. We have to continue, continuously refresh and, and reinvent the front end of the car. So what we show in the show cars is, of course, also a test. How does it work out? How does the, how does the customer, the public uh, react? And then we transfer it into production. I see there's carbon fiber on this grill. Is that something more for the show stand or is that something we might see in production? Definitely you will see it in production. Maybe not with the, with the basic version of the, of the A3, but we continuously develop the carbon pieces also in our RS model. So what you will see during the year now with the S6, the S7 and the S8, you will see a lot of carbon pieces also in the body panels because it's also a question of weight optimization. So we really want to do uh, the cars more efficient and therefore we have to do them more light, more aerodynamic. So this will be reserved for our RS models and maybe we will be happy and see one day on RS3 with a lot of these carbon pieces. That would be wonderful. The last question we have is from Dimitri Karas. He's wondering when the A3 will be refreshed, and I'm guessing he means when this model will, will launch, but also uh, what the most dramatic revisions will be from this car to the last. You know, we, we have been working now during the last four years on the new A3 family, and uh, the classical family contains, of course, the free door, the sport bag, the sedan now, new, and a really nice cabrio as well. And the, the first family member is the free free door, which will be on the market ne beginning of next year. And then almost every five months, one new family member will be on the market. I'm guessing Dimitri is from the United States. What of those models will apply to the US? 
One thing for sure, the Sedan will be in the United States. So we all are able to look forward. Stefan, I thank you for your time. Thank you, John.